Hello and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about how to enable important privacy features in the LibreWolf browser. These settings will help protect your online privacy by making it harder for websites to track you. Let's get into it. First, open your LibreWolf browser. Click on the menu button in the top right corner of the browser. Select settings from the drop down menu. In the left sidebar, click on LibreWolf. Scroll down to fingerprinting. Now let's focus on enabling the resist fingerprinting feature. This feature will make it harder for websites to track you using your device's unique attributes. By enabling this, your browser will take measures to make you less identifiable by websites trying to track you. Next, let's enable letterboxing. Letterboxing adds a black border around your browser window to make your screen size less unique. This reduces the chance of being tracked based on your window size. Finally, we'll enable the feature to silently block Canvas access requests. Canvas fingerprinting is a method websites use to track your device by drawing invisible images in your browser. This will block requests to access your browser's canvas, preventing sites from using this method to identify you. Now, let's discuss WebGL. WebGL is a powerful tool for displaying 3D graphics on the web, but it can also be used for fingerprinting. If you don't mind the potential tracking risk, you can leave WebGL enabled as it enhances the performance of many websites. This will enable WebGL, allowing websites to use 3D graphics. And that's it. You've now enabled important privacy features in LibreWolf, including resist fingerprinting, letterboxing, canvas blocking, and WebGL. Your browser is now more secure but WebGL is enabled for those who need better graphics support. If you found this video helpful, please like, comment, and subscribe for more privacy tips. Thanks for watching.